and welcome to Nightingale Fold at Steeple Claydon in Buckinghamshire and this is the amazing Ascot House type, a five bedroom home. This beautiful double fronted bovis house with its tile hung elevation is an absolute stunner of a property. Let's go and take a look inside. Hello, welcome Hello. to the Ascot. Yes. And that's at Nightingale Fold by Bovis Homes yeah, at right. Steeple Claydon in Buckinghamshire. And the Ascot is a favourite. It's beautiful. Probably one of my all time favourite house types, it's just gorgeous. It's got five yes. lovely bedrooms brimming with it's space. So uh, we've already got we've already got an ascot on. Yeah, but it was um, a long time ago that we saw an ascot. That was so in Cambridge, I think. Yeah. Um but uh, this is a brand new one. I don't mm -hmm. think this has been open too long. It's a very impressive house from the outside. So let's get going. We've got this big hallway. Look at that. That the hallway is almost like a room in itself. It's a substantial house, isn't it? It's fair to say. Yeah. Really, really beautiful. Right, well, where shall we start? Shall we start in the study? Yeah, let's go for it. Right, let's find some dimensions. 3 metres 38 by 1 metre 99. So that is sort of double fronted, isn't it? I mean, the Ascot actually comes in various different kind of elevation or finishes as well. And different things like different bays. Some, some of the Ascot hasn't got bays. But that's got one of this shares one of the two bays that um, is on this house. But it's a good size it's study. It's a nice additional space, doesn't it? Yeah. This study? But it's a big room, isn't it? So on this side, we've got the dining room again at the front with the bay. But because this is a side plot, on it's on the side they've actually squeezed another bay in there. Yeah. Three meters ninety by three meters forty five for this dining room. Beautifully dressed. Also beautiful. And I just want to say, um, Bovis are bringing a new range of house types called the, the Phoenix range mm -hmm. and a lot of the original designs such as the Ascot have been um, looked at, rethought about and the whole new range of house types are coming out. I just can't get over a big, how big this yeah. hallway is. I love the hallway, yes, but you can literally do this all the way around. That shows you how yeah. much space you've got in here. There's another stairs cupboard where Henry's yeah. hiding. So in there you've got some additional sockets and also your yeah. bit for your modem. So in here, what have we got here? If you want to open that door, Steve, because otherwise I'll open it onto you. Well, we've, whoa, that, that's it's your the cylinder. yeah big cylinder tank in yeah, there. Joe, you, know, it, it's not, you can you can't even hear it though. It's very quiet. Yeah. It's very accessible there, yeah, though, isn't it? Yeah. So that's your downstairs cloakroom, but also your utility room as well. Yeah. So it's nice here. You've got that um, Bovis uh, push flush there. Ideal standard sanitary wear as well. Suspended sink. Yeah, that's quite nice. I just standard, nice square shape as well. Nice. I mean, this feature is something we see in yeah. Bovis homes. It's a Bovis thing. Well, yeah, it is. Yeah, where you've got the utility and the cloakroom all in one, a bit of a space in the right. You've got your boiler in there and the controls all nicely boxed in. So they've got a washing machine there, but you've got room 
Yeah. For another reply. What's that little cupboard? What's that little cupboard about? Mm, it's just storage. Yeah. Blue rolls. Ample size for, for Lou roll. It's got a window as well. Also, we've got the RCD box there and the alarm box there. All, all the nicely tucked away in this room. I like to it's see very that. Very useful room, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, let's take a look at the lounge. It's a huge living room, isn't it? Yeah. Beautiful. It's got an open a log burner there as well, look. Sitting room, 5 metres 55 by just over the 5 metres, which is 18 foot 3 by 16 foot 7. So it's just um, showing here, you can just see on there what you get, so we're basically saying um, what you're getting much more. So you're getting bifold doors as standard, yep. um, the log burner, the TV area port, mortar media point and a choice of flooring, yep. all that. Because what, what you actually realise is with Bovis you get a lot more Isn't it? as standard. But obviously it is a show home, yeah. so it's dressed yeah. to show it to its best potential. So now what the show, what the uh, the lovely sales ladies told us that usually they have these doors open, oh well they yeah. have done for the last few weeks, but today <laughs> is the first day it's rained in absolutely weeks, unfortunately. So. But that is a whole wall of glass, isn't it? Yeah. But look how that garden, that lovely composite deck in there invites you out there, doesn't it? Yeah, what a lovely space. Now this site is very much under construction, as you can see, there's a lot of work going on here. It's a busy site. It's a great little village as well, actually. We're not, you know, we're not too far away, not too far away from Buckingham. It's almost sort of, sort of sandwiched in between um, Beaster and Milton Keynes. Yeah. We're sort of Buckingham just on the fringe of that. Um, so, what have we got amenities wise here? In the actual village? Yeah. Um, the usual things there's a, there's a local co op, there's um, a nice bakery, primary school, nurseries, there's a, a larger senior school very close by. So, you know, everything that you need yeah. for everyday life. Yeah. But what an impressive lounge. Yeah, so approximately 11 miles from Beaster here. Yeah. So we've got the kitchen and a sort of family room yeah. at the back there. Kitchen, which is we've nice. got another dining area, family yeah. area. So you've got those double doors again that lead onto that deck. So what do we know about education, Emma? So. As I've just said, there's, there's a nursery and a primary school in the village. Yeah. Uh, and for older children, there's a senior school. So well equipped, well. isn't it? Yeah. yeah. There's everything you need. So this has got. So we've got a table, table and chairs here, and we've got, you know, this little bit of living space, which is quite nice. A nice, nice sofa in there. Lots of aerial TV points, etc. What I do have here is uh, is a booklet actually about Nightingale Fold. So as much of this information as we can get in the description box will be down below. So yeah. please check that out. If you're wanting more detailed information, it'll all be in there. Or you can contact Bovis directly. Right, let me give you some dimensions for the kitchen and family area. Right, so in length, you've got 8 metres 31. Ooh, that's quite Yeah, good. by 4 metres 45. So that's just over 27 feet in length this room yeah. by 14 foot 7. So the, but, uh, just just on this side, we've got yeah. this bank of cupboards at the back here. Let's have a little look at those because there's no shortage of storage space, yeah, is there? The, ki the kitchen is, uh, is epic. You can put everything you want in here, your colouring box, your, your dinner service, yeah, really everything. Good. Right, let's, well, I'm gonna take, let's take a closer look at this it's kitchen. It's a big kitchen, there's a it lot really of cupboards is. and units. Pop-up cupboards. And obviously you have a choice of... So you say this has got such a lovely colour to this. Yeah, it's a matte grey, isn't it? Yeah. Lovely. Two ovens. Two ovens. Right, what have we got here? What was a great feature, that? The pull-out larder. Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, so, me. a very large fridge and freezer. Yeah. And a bottle of champagne. Oh. And a bit, look at that. Isn't that a beautiful kettle? 
I saw it when we came in, and they've got the toaster to match. Now that really is lovely. I really like that. Okay, so plenty of eyeline cupboards then. Down below, plenty of uh, storage. Beautiful work surface. So they've got a one and a half bowl sink. We've got integrated dishwasher. Beautiful, how the, uh, the drainer is, is actually into the work surface. Yeah. That's, that's really beautiful. Some beautiful big drawers here below the hob, which are little really cutlery drawers at the top really, as well. Really look, useful. see them. Look, if you open one up again, pull the top drawer out. Oh, the out. pull out, yes. Cutlery drawers, aren't they? Nice. Cutlery, so well thought way. out, isn't it? Yeah. But drawers are actually really popular now. Yeah. They're much easier. Do you know what I like as well about these cupboards? They've got a lovely little beading around the outside, haven't they? Kind of. Yeah, they're moulded, aren't yeah. they? But obviously the choice of doors is, yeah. is down to you individually. And they've got a gas ring now with five burners. With your oh, I've just banged my head on the hob on the. Uh, Oops, <laughs> I've done that many times. Okay, so they've got a, a gas hob with five burners with your big one in the middle for your wok or your frying pan or whatever. Uh, extractor here above, that's beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. Right. So let me just have a little look around the kitchen a little bit more, give them a bit more detail. Absolutely no shortage of sockets here at all. Very spacious kitchen, room for absolutely everything. I was just going to say, if you turn around, Steve, you've got more cupboards here along the bottom coming down yeah. from the uh, the fridge, and some big drawers here on this side. So, I mean, they've got another dining table here, around, you know, a breakfast table, but because you've got your dining room, you can have a table in here yeah. if you want. You don't necessarily we have to. Very, very flexible space. You've got all your media points down there for your TV, etc. Lovely. So, allow me to take you upstairs. Mm. So, we've got this lovely, this lovely, uh, that wallpaper is really nice. So, let's head upstairs. Oh, look at that landing, it's huge. I know. We've got five bedrooms up here to have a look at. Wow. That's beautiful, isn't it? Certainly oh, got the size. Anyway, what That's bedroom really are we going gorgeous. in next? Right, we'll go in there, bedroom three. Right. So we're above the dining room. So you've got the bay there that carries on up. Oh, look at it out there, that lovely summer rain look. Look at that house type over there. That's another Ascot as well there. That's in white render. Um, it's what? Isn't it's it? got a beautiful front garden as well. This property has as well, isn't it? Anyway, so like you say, we've got this bay window. Yeah, and you can see the one over there. Look, it's got the black windows. Yeah, matching the roof tiles. Gorgeous, you know what? isn't it? It's actually got a proper chimney. Oh, normally yeah. just stick. Well, one that's of those. from the the log burner. Yeah, they yeah. normally just stick a portico, but uh, you can't argue with that. So good size room. Beautiful. Right, let's have a look for some uh, dimensions. Three meters fifty. By two meters ninety-three, so eleven foot six by nine foot seven. Mm. Oh, that's lovely. That. You know, I like the uh, accessories. I can't get it open. Put it back down. Right. Beautiful. Very, very pretty room. Right. So then we've got a bathroom. So what we've got, ooh, we've got a bit of a, a list here of what we've got with it. So ideal standard at bathroom suite. So you can see that actually that is really nice there. Um, I like the taps. squared. Yeah. The squared bathtub. Yeah. It's very nice, isn't it, with the central taps. White towel rail. Yeah. Steve in pink today. Mm. Or salmon. And shorts. And shorts, yeah. Although so, it is raining. We've got your hair washing shower head there, which is really, really useful. Yeah. And look at the mermaid. Half a mermaid. She's in half. No, she's not anymore. Look at that. Do you know what she looks like? She doesn't even go together properly, look. You know you get magicians where they have the lady in the box and they get sawn in half. Yeah. 
Okay. I wonder what happened to her. Is that a nice bit of coral there as well? I think she's a bookend. Possibly. In a in a bathroom, yeah. Maybe. But maybe you could have her on a shelf with some books in between. What sort of yeah. Who okay. knows? Okay, right. so we've got a stepping shower with a separate bath. So okay, there's the a shower. Shower. Okay. Okay, there so you go. Plenty of yeah. room in there. And we've got tiles. Now, this word here, okay. I have a bit of trouble pronunciation on, st I in particular have a, a pronunciation problem with bathroom um, furniture fixtures and fittings. So I know there's one person who corrected me on the Russia thing lately. Now can you tell me how to pronounce that then? Okay, get back to me. Um, so we've got LED down lighters and a heated towel rail within this bathroom. I think it's porcelanosa. Porcelainia, yeah, porcelainia. Yeah, I'm not even going to try. Ceramic tiles, anyway. You know what we mean. We, it's the tiles. We have somebody on showrooms online who will know what that is. And it's not Russia, it's Rocker. Rocker, that's yeah. what she said. Well, anyway, I, also, you've got LED down lighters. I've already said that. And the heated towel rail right behind right. you. Right. And it's got a window. You can't argue with that. And a nice sink as well. Yeah, both suspended. Yeah, lovely. The there you go. Mm, can't argue with it's that. It's a very nice bathroom. Okay. Very, very nice. Right, so next we've got bedroom four, which is at the back of the house. So here we are above the lounge. Right, as you can see, it's quite a gloomy day outside today. No, but uh, turn the light on, Emma. Let me put, put the big light on. It's looking helpful, I think. Yes, right. there you go. Just over the three metres by two metres 89. So, ten foot one by nine foot six. So in terms of additional bedroom. furniture, I think you could get you could we could get a wardrobe in here just just you there could. potentially. Yes. Um, lots of sockets. Okay. It's all right, isn't it? Sockets it's a good size room. Things. Yeah, it's a good size double, I'd say. Yeah. Yeah. Very very nice. It's a beautiful, spacious landing. Right. So you are in bedroom five. Well, this has been dressed as a single room yes. single bed and believe it or not this is actually the smallest of the five bedrooms but still a really substantial sized bedroom three meters 89 by two meters 48 i like this room it's got a kind of nice feel about it i certainly like the wall yeah i think that's lovely there's something very simple about this room just a simple furnished simply i like it well, I think it's a stylish house right the yeah. way through, actually, with the interior design. It's very, very nice. So Pink. back to bedroom five. The blinds as well add a little bit of a mood to the house, I like. That's what I like. Can I just pop round to the front here next? In there, we've got a cupboard. Useful, yeah, isn't carpeted it? as well. Very nice. It looks like an airing cupboard without the... Oh, well, yeah, without the... Uh, the tank, yeah. if you like. So there's a lovely window here, then again at the front. So you're over the front door here. Yeah. They've got a chair. You can have a desk if you wanted. We've got a loft access above there. Yeah. Well, that's okay. Instead of someone's bedroom, it's in. It's on yeah. the landing where you can get your ladders to it. So at the front here, then this is bedroom two. So you're actually above the study, at back at the front of the house. Yeah, we do need the lights on today. Yeah. measurements bedroom two just over the four meters by two meters 93 so 13 foot two by nine foot seven and this bedroom has got a dressing room and an ensuite so it's got the it's got the bay window as well yeah. which is shared by the study so let's open let's get a light on in this room so nice nice um, dressing room quite a nice unit there as well isn't it it's nicely kitted out some yeah. beautiful sparkly shoes very very nice do you want to try, I'll try that hat on maybe do you want to yeah it go, it? i think it's is it a lady's hat i suppose I a bit of a is. go is there a mirror <laughs> that's mm. what emma does a lot of off camera i don't think it suits you no, i'm not a hat person myself well, judging from my hair today, I should need one. Yeah. Okay, so we've got an ensuite here. Um, 
the lights on. Yeah, so no, it's it's a good size. So you've got for suspended, yeah. suspended sink, WC with your push flush, you've got your own window, showers here behind the door. Let's have a look at our shower we got then. Nicely tiled, so yeah, it's quite quite simple, isn't it? That's all we need. It's just just the right size. Towel rail there behind you. I mean, in some houses, this would be the master, wouldn't yeah. it? But no, not in this house. And so it's got to. So this, so this is bedroom two, two. and it's got its own dressing room. Dressing room and So ensuite. bedroom one. Oh yes, yeah, so I've saved the best till last. Must be a cathedral. Oh yeah. Take a look at this. It's feathers. It's beautiful, isn't it? In the post box. But that just shows you the space in this yeah. house that you've actually got room for an additional piece of furniture on your landing right. This is bedroom one. But it's got its own entrance. In there you've got your dressing room and your ensuite. How mm, oh, beautiful yeah. is that? So let's pop the lights on. Right, you're going in the ensuite first then. So we get a full scale Full scale towel rail. You, like when I say full scale, look at that. Full, full, full height, you mean? Yeah, full yeah. scale, you know. You've got the little shower there, the little shower head for doing one's hair. So you've got the same sanitary wear that you've got in your main bathroom and in the other ensuite. So it's consistent right the way through, yeah. which is lovely. But the difference shower is, there. you get a bath and a shower in this master bedroom. This is almost the same as the main, be which uh, is main you, bathroom. You very there. rarely see. That's beautiful, isn't it? It's very, very nice. It's got a window as well, so all the bathrooms have got a window. So this is the dressing room. If you yeah. stand back, Steve, and then I can show the viewers what they've got in here. So this has been fitted out absolutely beautiful. So plenty of amazing storage space, which you certainly need. So this dressing room is kind of more the clothes are all hidden in wardrobes aren't they rather than the other ones quite an open sort of plan one isn't it? Oh the other dressing yeah. room? Yeah. Yeah well this is bigger than that one as well isn't it? And but, you, but I mean this is a house with two dressing rooms. You've even squeezed a window in really. Yeah. It's a good it's packs it's lovely, a punch. But you have got room for additional furniture out here on, yeah. your, on your entrance and then this is the beautiful master bedroom. So, bedroom one, dimensions, four meters 45 by three meters 73. Pop the lights on there, Steve. 14 foot seven by 12 foot three. Beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. So room for a substantial bed, additional furniture, Furniture at the side of the bed. I mean, if you've got other big furniture you wanted, you could have. You could even have a sofa in here. Yeah. It's beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. So, what does it say on here? Main bedroom, dressing room with integrated storage space, built-in wardrobes, dressing table, contemporary ensuite with your ideal standard um, sanitary wear, choice of tiles. Choice of ceramic, floor tiles, LED down lighters, heated towel warmer, step in shower and a shaver socket and a choice of flooring. Always useful to know, it's a very good thing to see actually that uh, you've got the list there. Come and have a look at this weather today. It's a bit, it is a bit, it is a bit it's miserable grim. look. It really is grim considering how absolutely beautiful the weather has been. Uh, obviously we like to film show homes on nice sunny days. <laughs> but we do and we planned it, we thought we were going to be lucky but no, yeah. not today. Well I hope you've loved the, the tour around the fabulous Ascot by Bovis Homes beautiful. and we uh, we have plenty of other Bovis house types on our channel. We do. Um, I will put all the information about this beautiful house and this development, Nightingale Fold, in the description box down below. Um, so check that out if you want further details and, and the spec of the room sizes, etc. But also there'll be a link back to Bovis Homes' own website so you can navigate back to them and get in contact with them directly uh, about prices and current availability because as you can see this site is currently under construction so it's a busy site. Uh, but please come and take a look because it's absolutely beautiful. 
Thank you very much for watching us. Thank you, and we will catch you on our next video. Bye. Bye for now.